Hello, this is Al, K0CM, and I'm here in the shack with my Alpha 8410 linear amplifier, and the task I have at hand is to install the power transformer onto the chassis. I've removed the cover. As you can see, it's disconnected from the power source, and I'm ready to proceed. I'm going to be installing this transformer myself, so I'm going to be rotating it onto its right side. And I'm going to rotate the amplifier onto its right side. In this position I'll be able to maneuver the transformer into the space provided on the chassis. With the transformer roughly in place I'll now be able to reach to the back side and install the bolts. And with a little maneuvering, we were able to align the holes and insert the bolts, and now the transformer is secure. Next, we'll connect the transformer to the amplifier. First, we have a Molex connector that we press into place. Next, we'll connect the 8-pin connector to the mains board. And finally, we'll connect a yellow connector to the lower high-voltage board. Well that's it for installing the transformer. Next we'll check the AC power setting. To select the proper AC line input voltage, we have a series of five fast on connectors and a flying jumper lead that allows us to select between 100 volts and 240 volts. We'll be using 240 volts here, so we'll leave the lead in that position. With that set, all we have left now is to visually inspect the amplifier and to replace the cover. Thanks to the straightforward layout of this amplifier, we were able to install the transformer with no problems. The transformer is installed, the cover is replaced, and we're ready to plug it in and put it to use. Thanks a lot for watching.